What makes you an expert, Dom? Dude, I've been scooping up damaged goods since freshman orientation at UConn. And I'm a super senior now, so that's like eight years experience, which is a decade. My name's Jenna. I am newly single. I do not give a fuck about what anyone thinks about me. Figure out who I am, what I want out of life. I'm gonna be Miss Independent and do my own thing. Figure out life, you know? No one gives a shit that you're single. Why are you always trying to find yourself? I'm pretty sure I found you last week on Dare Dorm getting stuffed by the Jackson 5. Well, Jackson 4. Girls, being single, it's a religion. And Twitter is their Bible. Twitter is like my diary. Oh my god, I got completely naked at a wet t-shirt contest. Hashtag single girl problems. SOS, I drank too much and now I'm in the hospital. Might have gotten assaulted. Hashtag single girl problems. Whoops, totally pregos. Fifth abortion this month. Hashtag single girl problems. Can you get pregnant five times in a month? My followers, they love me. How many followers do you have? 64. How many people do you follow? 8,000. Yeah, I follow girls into the bathroom. It's okay to act slutty because you just got your heart broken. And you're a mature woman now. And you and your friends are the cast of Sex in the City. And give me a fucking break. Do you, sister. Be all you can be. And less. You're self-centered. You're insecure. You don't know right from wrong. You're loud. You're emotionally dangerous. You're a liability to everybody around you. You're going downhill in general. And you're always attention hungry. And actually hungry. That's a recipe for self-destruction. Not to be confused with the recipe for cinnamon rolls. When a girl becomes single, she's got to make sure everybody around her knows. It's like an event that everyone needs to be a part of that no one wants to be a part of. Like a 5K for diabetes. Cancer? Oh, diabetes? Pfft, forget that. What am I walking for? They're the ones with diabetes. Girls feel the need to reinvent themselves. A total makeover. This means going out and dyeing your hair a slightly different color. Single girls also like making themselves huge targets. Me, being the man that I am, am an expert on preying on girls. Bitch, I am so ready to get shit face tonight. We are literally gonna go out and get wasted. Like, literally. Bitch, like, fucking white girl wasted. I couldn't help over here that you're newly single. May I interest you in some hypnotic and Sprite Zero back in my apartment style dorm? I'm a predator. A sexual fucking predator. I'm like a poon shark. I can smell tears from a mile away. What's that? Is that tears? Oh good, because I forgot my lube. I'm always on the prowl for girls about to enter the single world. Or as I like to call it, the Thunderdome. The first sign of fresh meat is a troubled Facebook post about her relationship. Like a quote from classic sluts such as Marilyn Monroe or Audrey Hepburn. Or just straight complaining. Sup, bitch? Yeah, no, Jeff broke up with me. Yeah, he's such an asshole. No, I'ma be alright. I'ma get a pint of Ben and Jerry's and masturbate to breakfast at Tiffany's. I'ma do me. Put my hand. Get your emotional garbage out of my newsfeed followed by the, uh, I'm definitely single and an independent woman Facebook post. Which directly translates to, I just got two tickets to the Thunderdome. One for me, and one for my emotional baggage. The photo album of her and her friends slagging around town, titled The Single Life. Body shots, making out with girls, and pics of her and her friends pissing on frat toilets. No one wants to see that. Some people want to see that. I kinda, I do kinda want to see that. And then BOOM! You just made my rape, my friend list. That's like Ashley Olsen from Full House? Girlfriends are always there to offer good advice. I really have the best friends in the world. They give me the best advice. No, do what you want to do. Whatever you think is right, it's your turn to turn into a butterfly and fly away. Guys are dogs and you're a girl. They just start whining about how lonely they are and how they can't find a good man. I've been single for a week and a half now. I cannot find a good guy. Independently wealthy, he's a little bit older than me, dresses in nice suits. Reminds me of my stepdad. I like that, but you know, not, not like in a creepy way, in a sexy way. I'm a single girl's dream. I'm completely dependent on my parents for cash. I'm mentally retarded. I dress like Dane Cook, and I'm like a father figure to girls, which Freud said is like shooting fish in a barrel. The best part about being a single girl is you can do whatever you want, as long as you call yourself a hot mess, and then say, oh, I'm gonna be a real person now. Oh my God, where's Karen? Where's my purse? I'm a hot mess when I'm single. Jackpot, let's do this. I have to black out. Like, that's how you know you have a good time and you're being a single girl. Like, I hope I go to the bar and get roofied. If that's how you want to play it, that's my speciality. That's where I shine. Bagels are the biggest part about being single. There's nothing sexier than a girl gnawing on a bagel in her clothes from the night before. You know, I am not a slut. I worked out yesterday and I just hooked up with this kid last night and, you know, I didn't have any carbs for six days, so. Oh, I can see you also broke up with Dr. Atkins. I want, I'm gonna work out, I'm gonna jump and dance. And you deserve that. Yeah, you know what I do. Bagels are a girl's best friend. They help you forget that you were just disrespected by the Dom Squad. I don't just like like someone and sleep with them like right after I meet them. So oh, yeah. like, I 
really like you. That, is oh, that alright? I'm sorry. Is this too fast? Like, no, I mean, like, yo, listen, like, you know, you're a really good girl or, like, whatever and that shit. But, like, I got, like, an Xbox tournament that I got to get to. Uh, so, if you could, like... Time for the bone hammer.